Right then, guys, here we go. The old Triumph just landed with us for our next sale. Uh, looks quite a well prepped car, this. Um, obviously, lovely old V8 in there. I'll fire it up in a minute and see what she sounds like. But um, no, overall, it's not concourse by any means, but looks a, uh, looks quite a level thing on a nice set of wheels. Good tyres. Nice and clean round the front bumper. Fairly good on the paintwork from what I can see. Strut tops and things are good. A few little bits here and there on the uh, inner wings, as you can see that side as well. But um, no, other than a bit of a detail and a clean off under here, all looks to be okay. Same with the bonnet, lips and edges and things. All looks fairly good. What we got on here, TR7, nine keepers, two keys, four spare wheels and a heri heritage certificate. We've got some spare wheels somewhere for this, yeah, have we? Four spare wheels. Is it? What, standard ones? I think so, yeah. Are they? Well, we better check it out, guys. We'll get some photos of it anyway for you. But there you go, in a lovely, uh, lovely sort of gold. Wide arch. Soft top looks to be in good condition. A little bit of a clean, but overall no major rips or tears or anything. Looks to be very good. Nice and straight down this passenger side. Yeah. Yeah, good round the boot. Oh, I do remember now. I did, yeah, I have had this going. Yeah, we, uh, I drove it into the shed. Yeah, don't use full lock. I think it's just catching with them wheels and such like. If you go full lock, it just catches a little bit from memory. So uh, they might just want a little bit of offset, a little bit of adjustment. But, um, Ah, interior wise look, nice and tidy on the driver's seat, losing a little bit of padding there at the bottom but nothing much. Passenger seat looks good as well as door cards. Dashboard and things looks tidy. Mats and things are clean, same with the carpet. A little bit just been touched in around the door shuts and such like. Obviously where it's had a fair bit of paint, but um, overall the paint job in all fairness it's a little bit ripply maybe if you're being fussy in places but overall yeah very good yeah not too bad yeah yeah a little bit you know wouldn't hurt from a flat and a polish in places but um no overall not a bad job rear roll bar there fitted as you can see look but uh no she looks all right is that battery nice later on or off extinguisher mounted in the back Oh no, we are on. Let's see what she does. Uh, there we go, fuel pump's ticking away. Is that the new choke? Bit of that. Just let that pump go for a second. 55353 three showing on the clock. You better check all that out for yourself. Obviously, we can't guarantee any of that, guys. Oh, there you go, she's away. Rev gauge is working. Yeah, that sounds nice. Yeah, she does sound nice. sound of a V8 really can you? <laughs> yeah no that sounds lovely. There you go. She's down on display here at Pickering guys so um, yeah feel free to pop down and have a look. Better check it all out for yourself. Just bear in mind these videos are purely just to give you a little bit of a oh she's cut out better understanding than um, than just going off the photographs of course so um, you know they're just a bit of a step up from the photographs really aren't they so um, please do come down check it all out for yourself make sure you're happy with the car but um, no, I think it's worth traveling for yeah looks like a, to be a real good user just turn that off stop that fuel pump but um, yeah there you go bit of paperwork and such like in the office so come and have a flick through as well there you go, I'll call it there. Thank you.